The following instruction will guide you through the steps required to make print and mock-up file for reward jar. First download the template. When preparing your print file, you need to reference our PSD print template that you can download from the product link on our website under the mock-up and template tab. Open and edit the file. To set up print file, open the downloaded template in Photoshop or, or you will need an alternative that has the ability to work with smart objects like Photopia. When opened, follow the instruction in the guide note. Prepare and get your artwork ready. First, create cut shape design for the top and bottom layer. Double click on the design layer thumbnail to open the smart object. Create or drag your design into the work surface. Adjust and place design within the safe print area. Important notes for cutting design details. All cut shape layers must be black filled. Make sure that all artwork elements are connected and combined into a single object and should not contain empty objects or open contours. The transparent area in the design will be cut out. Your artwork must be cleanly presented on a transparent background. When done with shape design, save smart object control plus S. Make sure to either delete or turn off with the eye icon the original image and guide layer. Go back to the original PSD file, turn on the customizable parts group, you'll find four customizable layers are automatically generated. Cut out shape top or front layer is clear top plate. Cut out shape bottom or back layer is backing wood plate. And this print will be decorative trim, cover the edge beneath and used to align the custom inner print. Put or create your design for the top layer's print here, within this edge. Cut out shape middle or spacing layer. This shape will be edge glued, adhering the three layers of material together. This is an automated setup for the space of the opening to put the charms in. If you want to modify the mouth size and position of the opening, right-click on the layer. Select and mask. Choose Lasso tool then create a new selection for your preferred subject, then OK. You will see the new cutout shape and the spacious area providing storage for up the charms. Next, drag or design your artwork for the bottom layer. You can use the cut shape design or make different design. Continue to make set of charms or tokens. Isolate each object and place within this box area. The objects in this area will be used for both printed and cutting out. No maximum number of charms, however, the size of each piece should be smaller than the opening width. Important note for printed design details. All text should be a minimum of 20 pixel. Elements at this size or smaller run the risk of not printing correctly. All pixel-based artwork or raster image needs to be a minimum of 300 dpi dots per inch. Less than 300 dpi and your artwork might print dotty or fuzzy. Export the file. When finished designing, then save the design file in n-transparent format, make sure that you turn off the guide layer and remove unused objects from your file. Generate mockups from print file. Open downloaded mockup file. Pay attention to the note here. Double click on the place your design here layer thumbnail to open smart object. Drag and place your design file into the Smart Object work surface. 
To make a realistic effect for the charm display, separate each charm object into separate layers and put them inside the cut shape area. Back to the mock-up file, you will see your design generated. Save the file for your own use.